Hi everyone, Happy New Year to you all. And I've promised to bring you more video content this year. So this is the first of many. Um, and one of the biggest questions I get is, is about these shaggy rugs. Now we've just had the Christmas trees up. I've literally just taken mine down. And in here, I know there's gonna be lots of glitter and lots of bits of pieces. So one of my quick tips is, is just to literally Stand up, we're gonna turn the rug over now. Now this tip goes back to sort of Victorian times when they used to literally take their big bits of carpet outside, used to bash them, hang them over a washing line and used to bash them with like an old tennis racket or an old broom. And when you bash a rug, you're literally getting out all that debris. Now vacuums, as good as they are, will get a lot of it out. But when you've got a shaggy rug like this, a lot of it is still gonna be stuck in there. So I'm just gonna flip it over. You might need some help with this. So if you do, make sure you find someone to help you. So all flipped over. You can already hear some bits and pieces came out there. So when you've got it onto the reverse side, just like this, you then need to grab your vacuum. Now what you're gonna do with the vacuum is, which probably sounds really, really strange, is you're gonna be vacuuming the rug going up and down in stripes. And what this will do is, the vacuum is then pushing out um, the debris, the dust, the glitter, and it's also gonna bring your pile back to life. So now you've finished your vacuuming, you can do the test. So I'm gonna pull the rug back. And if you look here, can you see, look, all that glitter. And if I just run my hands onto my wooden floor, you will see all the glitter and the dust that has come out of the rug because I've hoovered it backwards and this way round. So this is a really, really good tip. Um, if you have got sort of a long shaggy piled rug, then what you can do is, is obviously give that a vacuum to make sure you get all those bits up. And then continue to do the whole area. So just pull your rug back. Jump in, be careful of your socks. And you can still see that if you come down here, look, we've got these bits and pieces here that haven't come up with a normal vacuum. So there's all these bits coming out of my rug. So all this gets vacuumed up. Once you've turned your rug back over, you'll notice now that the pile on your rug actually looks newer and fresher. It's looking more like it is when it's first bought into your home. Um, so next time you're doing a bit of a deep clean and you've got a rug in the room, just make sure you flip your rug, get all the debris out, all the glitter out, all the dust and those particles, and your rug will feel like new again. Thank you for watching.